Hello everyone. Building a successful website without data is hard. Like doing a tightrope walk blindfolded it is possible. But it's way easier with the lights on. Google Analytics turns on your website's metaphorical lights to reveal who's visiting it, how they're finding it, and what they're doing there. You can then use this data to confidently put one foot in front of the other to improve your website. Google Analytics 4 is a web analytics tool from Google that lets you track and measure user traffic and behavior on your website for free. It's used by an estimated 28.8 million websites, giving it an estimated 85.9% share of the web analytics market. You started your website to inform potential customers of your products or services and convert them into loyal customers. To do this effectively, you need to know where visitors come from, what they're most interested in, and which touchpoints help turn them into customers. Recording and analyzing your data with GA4 will help you build digital marketing strategies to attract more visitors and make more money. So today in this video we will be sharing the guide on what is Google Analytics for and how to set up it for websites. Before we continue, check out our latest posts at our Instagram and press the follow button for new updates and news. Let's dive into the video. So what has changed? In short, but a lot. Google Analytics 4 uses a completely different data structure and data collection logic. Let's take a more detailed look at the tool and discuss the most noticeable changes. First one is cross-platform tracking. Previously, if you wanted to measure your website data, you needed to work with your Google Analytics property for tracking website data. Now all data across your website and app are gathered in one account. The new GA4 combines web and mobile app traffic usage data into one property in one interface. This is possible with a new architecture that lets us install cross-device tracking and unify data across devices. With the help of GA4 and cross-device tracking, marketers can now holistically view the customer journey across devices. Second one is deeper Google Ads integration. Google Analytics 4 has deeper integration with Google Ads. You can use data from GA4 to build custom audiences that are more relevant to your customers and target them with paid or organic campaigns. Besides, GA4 will report on actions from YouTube engaged views that occur in-app as well as on the web. Marketers now can have a more global view of their results, with the ability to see conversions from Google and non-Google paid channels, YouTube video views, Google search, social media and email. Third one is AI-powered predictions and insights. Google is a leader in machine learning, and it's no surprise that advanced machine learning, as the main form of data measurement, has been applied in Google Analytics 4 to detect trends in data and alert users about them. GA4 uses machine learning to help digital marketers through two features, predictive metrics and automated insights. Google Analytics 4 supports three predictive metrics, purchase probability, revenue prediction, and churn probability. By using AI, Google Analytics 4 can give marketers and users automated insights about their visitors, customers, and customer journeys. With their help, GA4 can automatically alert marketers to data trends. Fourth one is free Bickery integration. One of the most exciting features in GA4 is the ability to access and export raw data from Go to Google Bickery. Earlier, Bickery integration was available only for Google Analytics 360 but in GA4 it's available to everyone at no additional cost. Sampling was always a problem in Universal Analytics, especially when you worked with really huge datasets. With Bickery integration, you can do your data analysis on entirely raw, unsampled data. As a result, your analysis will be more accurate and powerful than ever. Fifth one is Google Signals. Google Signals is an advertising reporting feature that allows marketers to collect cross-device data on individuals who are signed into a Google account for which they have turned on ad personalization. Google Signals launched in 2018, but this integration between Google Signals and Google Analytics 4 is a huge update, now this functionality can be used in all reports, while previously it was applied only to a few pre-built reports. Data from Google Signals is aggregated and GDPR compliant, as there is no personally identifiable information. Sixth one is event-based model. Universal Analytics relies on different hit types such as page view, event, social interaction, and e-commerce. In GA4, everything is now an event. An events-based model processes each user interaction as an autonomous event across all web and app visits. Event building is one of the most significant Google Analytics 4 features. First one is automatically collected events. Second one is recommended events. 
Third one is enhanced measurement events. Fourth one is custom events. Sometimes the thought of setting up Google Analytics can seem a little daunting, especially if you are not familiar with the process. The purpose of this video will be to explain in as much detail as possible how you can improve your e-commerce website by setting up Google Analytics. Do the following steps to set up Google Analytics for. The following steps are for those who already have a universal analytics property. You can set up the GA4 with the help of the GA4 Setup Assistant. Go to Google Analytics account and click Admin on the left side of the screen. Select the desired account in the Account column. Select Universal Analytics Property in the Property column. It is the current property that collects data on your website. Then select GA4 Setup Assistant in the Property column. You can see, I want to create a new Google Analytics 4 property. Click Get Started. If your website uses a Tages tag, you should select Enable Data Collection using your existing tags. Then, click Create Property. We have come to the conclusion part of the video now. Google Analytics 4 is a powerful tool that gives website owners an edge in their marketing decision-making, which in return yields profits beyond measure. It is a tool that enables you to adjust the way you interact with your customers based on the action they take on your site. It's a tool that gives you more control over how you track important metrics like conversions, organic traffic, returning visitors, revenues and lots more on your site. And you take this powerful tool to the next level by connecting Google Search Console with your Google Analytics 4 property to give an unstoppable analysis of what's happening on your website. In this video I have explained only few terms. But would you like to know about more how to set up Google Analytics for your websites? Read our latest blog article to get what is Google Analytics for and how to set up it for websites. If you need any help related to digital marketing services, our team at Digifix is more than happy to help you. Visit our website for more information. See you again in another video.